To hide the cursor or webcam over a section of your recording, you would first seek to where you want to start hiding. Then you would click the Tools menu button above the timeline, and then Hide, and then choose either Cursor or Webcam, or you can just press the H key, then the C or W key to start the tool. Select the section by dragging the orange bar along the timeline, or if you click on the start or end of the span, then you can use the arrow keys to fine-tune your selection. You can also click around the timeline, then use the S key to jump the start to that point, or the E key to jump the end to your current seek point. If you want to preview what it will look like, then you can press the Preview button, which will seek right before the section, then play through it and stop shortly after the section. Once you're ready to commit, you press the OK button or press Enter. Anytime you make a change to the recording, it is automatically saved on your computer. After the edit is added, a colored span will show on the timeline where you added the hide. If you want to undo it, you can seek back to that spot on the timeline and click this icon, which will bring up a menu with another icon you can press to remove it, or you can adjust the section by dragging the ends. You can also use the Undo or Edit History dropdown to go back in time before you added the edit if you'd like to remove it. The last used tool will be listed next to the Tools button above the timeline, so you can easily use the same tool again by clicking on it here. Create, share, and experience video with Screencast-O-Matic.